Hello there, Brick Amigo fans, and welcome to our fourth building episode, where we are going to continue to talk about our custom LEGO City. So as you can see now in the picture, we've got the start of two brand new buildings, which are our headliners for this episode, so uh, we'll make sure to go into a lot of detail about both of them. So this tan-colored one right here is a luxury condo that we've been working on. Got some nice details on the side here. It's still not complete, I'm going to add. We still have a little bit of stuff to do. I'll talk about what we're still going to do with it later, though. So it's got these uh, nice side details here, this kind of stuff. Cool little lion sticking out. We finally found a way to use that one piece that we got. The bad thing about that is we just have that one piece, so that was a good way to use it. Windows, 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 and a rooftop. And on the rooftop here, you've got this cool door thing, little door thing, little plant. And what the rest of the rooftop is going to hold is it's going to be like a little community garden for the people of this place. So we've still got to work on that. That part. Hopefully we'll be all done by next time, because next time I hope to have some detailed work done. That's right, we're going to do detail work. I'm sorry I lied last time. We wanted to do some aggressive expansion over here, so detail stuff is coming next week, okay? And then the next building here, this one, hospital. We kind of stuck with the classic Lego color of hospital, red and, yellow, uh, red and blue, I can't talk, red and white. So kept those two things here, got some more doors. Huge window along this side here, cool there. Then these big windows right here, and then this side is all just going to be blank. We might have another uh, hospital sticker along the side. So that's this building. There will definitely be an inside of this building. Haven't started it yet because we got to finish the outline of the building. So that's that's going to be done by the next time. Like the outline, I mean, we might have some of the inside done too. Then if you move over, you've got the just very beginning of another building. This building is going to be another luxury condo with, in front here, is got, it's going to have a courtyard or sort of a, uh, how do you call it, plaza type, type area. So that's going to be in here, 16 by 16, and then this is going to be the building in the back here. That's that. We haven't uh, started that really except for the very beginning and just planning of that, so that's there. Um, extra new things. We finally finished. The garage. The garage is all done. Yay! Hooray! So, it's got this door again. And if you can see right here, really two, really cool two windows, uh, skylight windows, all nicely done. Only thing we might add is we might add a little sort of air conditioning system on the top or some kind of ventilation thing because we have to do roof type stuff. Gas station, all done except for the convenience store, not done yet. And this building here. See, the sad thing about this is that we built it but then both unanimously decided that it's garbage and we're going to tear it out. So, if you like it, I'm sorry. You're not getting it. It's going to be gone within a week. Bye-bye. Boom. Boom! Moving over to Town Hall. Nothing has changed. Hooray! Actually, I'm lying. A few things have changed. Gone up one row here. Finally finished the columns. That's the height we want them. Really should have done that a long time ago, I think. But, uh, yeah, we finally finished that, so... Maybe, maybe again next time we'll have Town Hall a little bit further along. The thing with Town Hall that the, is the hardest is that we really don't know how we want to build it. We've kind of just said we want a Town Hall, but we didn't think about a plan for it. So hopefully we can think of a plan and start sort of start it. Because yeah, it really looks bad to just keep going every episode and have this just that little bit done. So um, I, I make no promises, but I hope next week there will be a little bit. Then if you look at the police station exactly the same as last time except we're starting on this in inner wall over here and that's the next thing is that we're we're going to work on is the detailing of the inside of the police station so that will be uh done for next episode and then as you can see here a little bit of a little bit of new stuff a gigantic wall has risen a roof here there will be a roof here next time too we just got to do a little bit more work on this side part here and then we'll fix these two roofs up so those two buildings will be completely done hopefully because that's the kind of detailing stuff i want then, you go across the street, you've got the first building that has the inside of it done. Yeah! See the bank? This is going to be the city bank. We've got a sign that we've made here. Might do a couple changes, but that's the city bank sign. And this is the city bank. It's got a vault, a little vault. Might change the size of the vault, make it a little bit bigger. All across that side. Desk, filing stuff, ATM. There will be a table that we haven't added there. Just got to find uh, the right piece so we can place it in easily. And um, I think that's about it for new buildings. These two have stayed the same, stayed the same. Lego Store, Octan Corp. We gotta go up to the sky with that one. 
haven't done that yet. I think that, that'll be easy to be doing for next video. So, yeah, I promise that next video that will be building will be taller and not completely done. But it'll be better. Uh, what else? I guess most of it has happened over here. As I said, there was aggressive expansion with that little area over there. Um, so I think we can move on to what we got is the cars. We got three more cars to show you this week. This Jeep right here. This uh, utility or sort of vehicle. And this guy, uh, just a yellow sports car kind of thing. So this actually was originally from the gas station, the original Octane station, or the one that we got, I think, 2006. So that we just took the car, ripped it apart, and then remade it so that it's completely custom. Got a back sign here. This is the logo of some car company in Lego World. Got that coming back. Made it a little bit less smooth up, smooth up at the front. Might, might put something to like make it more smooth. I don't think so. I think it's all done. Nice and simple. Nice and easy. Vroom vroom. And this thing was from the airport. It's actually not changed too much. It's just a little bit. Uh, got different pieces on the side. Fixed up the back because the back looked absolutely horrendous. Made it look more, not just like, I think what it looked like before was just this piece on there, which looks really bad. So fix it up a little bit and makes, makes it, make it look a little bit more like a re, oh, I screwed it up. I'll fix it later. <laughs> uh, made it look like a little bit more like a real car. And then the last one, the Jeep. The Jeep was um, completely redesigned from the Toy Story one and made a lot more smooth and just better. It doesn't have a top, so it's just a convertible Jeep kind of car. Tire at the back, flat lights, everything. So yeah, it's completely redone from the Toy Story Jeep. And those are the three cars that we've got for you today. Otherwise, um, I think we're about done for this update video. You can see we've got some people here that we're making, getting ready to put into the city. Just a heads up too about that. Even though we make some people, we've already got some made. None of them are going in right now because it looked really silly. I mean, we had that one episode where we put in some guys from uh, the Lego movie, but that's not too important. I mean, they're just there for fun. None of the guys need to be here because we already we always move around pieces and things like that. So having Lego figures in the area would just mess it up more. So don't expect to see any of that in this in any, in any of these videos because you won't. I guess the last thing we'll talk about before we leave is. Uh, over on this side over here, this gigantic mess over here is where, again, we have started a little bit of work with the mall, just the basic idea, so I can sort of plan it out for you guys so you have an idea of what's going to be here. This is going to be a couple storefront windows. Um, I don't think that they're going to be side by side like that. Then the entrance will be right here, and there will be another department store right here. So if you can imagine this, we're going to have a nice entrance right here, diagonal. And this will be one of the buildings that you'll see the inside of because there will be a lot of detail on it. So that's that's another reason why it's taking so long is because we have to make sure we have all the pieces and uh, can just do it all. So that's really important. And yeah, imagine entrance there. And the construction site will be an addition onto the mall so that it will look like it's growing. And I think that's just about it. So. I hope you enjoyed the little preview of our mall and the rest of our city, and I hope to see you guys next week in our next update video. Brick Amigos out.